The Hitman's Bodyguard, starring Ryan Reynolds and Samuel Jackson. This movie, to me, is an escape. It's hilarious. It's funny. They overplay some of the jokes throughout the film. They kind of overplay how the word MF through the entire film. <coughs> it's one of those thrown-together films that is good for the enjoyment of just going to the movies and, and watching a good action movie. And Samuel Jackson character plays a hitman who's actually in the witness protection program because he's going to roll over on the dictator played by Gary Oldman, who's basically there to just improvise playing a character and working on another voice. <laughs> uh, the people who were crooked, basically, who you thought were good and end up being crooked. You kind of knew they were crooked because they never played a good guy before in their life. When I first saw the person, I'm like, he's playing a good guy? Oh, he's crooked. Okay. <laughs> now it makes sense. <laughs> so it all fits. So when you're looking at everything and like, well, let me see the perfect type of picture. When you're like, well, what could I really put here? This is a thing where Ryan Reynolds always tried to catch this guy. Like, he was a nemesis. Like, they tried to kill each other many a times doing jobs. And due to the fact that they tried to kill each other doing jobs, his ex-girlfriend knew that something was wrong in the department and they were going to try to kill him and all this. So she ends up saving him and taking him to a safe house and dump him on Ryan Reynolds. And now Ryan Reynolds is forced to work with him. So, you know, here we go. The movie starts. <laughs> and he really doesn't need Ryan Reynolds' help. But then again, he ends up, like, needing Ryan Reynolds' help. And it becomes the buddy cop movie after a while. And it, it becomes entertainment. You know, you, you're you entertained by it. And it's hilarious. Samuel Jackson is at his usual funny self, right along with Ryan Reynolds, with his 90s stick comedy. And they fit. I thought the chemistry between the two actually worked. And... Selma Hyatt is in a couple of scenes, but even in the scene she's in, it's funny. You know, it's really hilarious. So watching it, you're laughing because it's really entertaining. It's funny. So, I mean, I'm not going to say it's movie of the year, but it's definitely an escape. The movie has a lot of plot holes in it from the actual villain, the actual trial, the actual trying to escape custody a whole bunch of potholes in this thing but it's like it, the movie doesn't take itself that serious you will enjoy yourself and have a good time um i'll give it two and a half stars you know out of four and you will enjoy the hitman's bodyguard <laughs> i'm out